With both Uber and Lyft threatening to leave Minnesota July 1st, when the new driver pay increase begins, other rideshare companies are starting to move in to fill the void. WCCO's Kirsten Mitchell is live in Minneapolis, where the company Rides has begun their service. How's it going for them so far, Kirsten? Well, Sheila, they launched yesterday with just a handful of drivers, but they have big plans to scale up and scale up fast. In fact, they plan to hire another thousand drivers over the next week or so. Now, Rides joins My Wheels as the first newly licensed rideshare company here in Minneapolis. They're based out of Austin, Texas, but are now in 10 states, including here in Minnesota. Drivers take home 100% of the fare from rides, but of course there are challenges with starting up in a new city, like recruiting drivers and also just getting the word out to riders that the this service exists. But Rides founder Steve Wright says they are ready and will not be cutting any corners when it comes to safety. Anybody can sign up to drive or ride by going to rides.com. Uh, they can sign up to become a driver. They'll go through the process, the background check, uh, the, the whole uh, system, and then they'll come in for a face-to-face -face interview uh, with one of us. And uh, we also do drug testing for every driver as well. Right now, Rides is only in Minneapolis, but they're working hard to get licensed in St. Paul and also at the airport. Coming up tonight on WCCO News at 5, hear from My Wheels about their plans to enter the market too. Shayla? All right, our Kirsten Mitchell reporting. Thank you so much, Kirsten.